Hey guys, how's it going? I'm gonna give you some quick tips and tricks on how to strip sheathing off of wire and uh, also do some armored cable. I'm gonna show you a couple different tools we can use um, and we'll go from there. So some of the tools that make things easier with this stuff, uh, a hook blade knife or a banana knife as some guys call them. Pick them up for 20 bucks at Home Depot. Um, we got a nice pair of Klein Resi strippers. Got a Milwaukee X-Acto knife. And there's always this little cool tool I've seen guys use from time to time. So I'll show you guys how to use one of these as well. This is made by Commercial Electric. You can pick them up at Home Depot, 10 bucks. Okay. So with some 14-2 MD, okay, with one of these X-Acto knives. Okay, you can take the tip, you're gonna put it in the middle. Okay, you're gonna push it through. Okay, and pull. Peel back your sheath thing. Strip your tail off. Okay, and that's one way. Another way you can strip some 14 too, if these Klein Resi strippers, okay, if you can see how the uh, teeth are designed. Okay, put them over. Be careful how hard you push, because um, it's very easy to nick into the insulation on the actual conductors, and then that can cause you some problems. Um, but anyway, so you push, okay, pull, pull it right off. Very quick, easy, and simple. Uh, I think these are about 15 bucks Home Depot. Another way we can strip some 14-2, this hawk blade banana knife, okay? You can, you're you gonna run it down the side, okay, gently. These are very sharp. Okay. And you can pull your conductors out, like so. Pull them out, okay? And cut cut off that sheathing. Okay, so that's one way with the banana knife. Okay, I'll show you real quickly here with one of these. Okay, you got this slit here. Okay, you can take the wire, fit shit all the way through to your desired length. Okay, line that little blade up. Okay, in the middle. You're gonna push and pull. Okay. And that's gonna strip your sheet thing off. And then cut off your tail. Okay. Um, some 14.3. I'll show you a, a way to strip some 14.3. Okay, I like using these X-Acto knives. Okay, you're gonna gently score all the way around. Okay, again, you don't wanna push too hard. You don't wanna nick into those conductors. Okay. I don't know if you can see that there. Okay. All the way around. And you're gently just going to cut down. Okay. Like so. Okay, you get it started. And sometimes you can just pull it right off. Sometimes you might have to cut a little more. And there you go. Okay, next, some armored cable. You got some BX cable here, armored cable. Um, two ways we can strip it. One is with a pair of side cuts. Um, another way is with a hacksaw. The preferred and best method, I think, is the hacksaw, okay? I'll show you why. Okay, so for the first method with a pair of side cuts, okay, you're gonna choose your desired length, okay? Fold, okay, till it breaks, okay? With your right hand, you're gonna twist this way. With your left hand, you're gonna twist towards you at the same time, okay? That's gonna expose a rib, push it out for you. You can take your side cuts. Okay, you're gonna cut that rib. And pull it off. Trim back your tail. Okay, pull your paper off. And you're ready to go. You put your anti short in here and then put it into the box. Okay. The preferred method. Okay, you're gonna take a hacksaw. Okay. 
I'm gonna choose your desired length. Let's say I wanna cut it here on this rib. I'm gonna go over on the rib on an angle. Okay, we're gonna make a cut. Okay, so we'll cut through there. Okay, we'll give you a little break and then you can pull it off from there. Okay, um, real quickly, maybe just some dryer wire. Okay, this is 10-3. I like using the banana knife on this and same thing as the 14-3, okay? You're gonna lightly, lightly score all the way around. Okay, you can see there. Okay, and then you're gonna take your blade and you're just gonna run it down maybe two inches. Okay, peel it off, peel it back. And originally from there, you can just pull it off. And there you are, you're all set. That's all I got for you today, guys. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, let me know what you think, and let me know if there's uh, any other things I can give you guys a hand with. And until uh, next time.